After installing WordPress, there are some basic settings that you have to configure. So from dashboard, navigate to the settings and permalink. Change the permalink structure to the post name because I do not want to display my URL looks like this, uh, including date and uh, year and then page name or the post name. I do not want to display my post or page URL looks like this. I want to make it simple and that's why I'm gonna select post name. So this is the post name which is only after your domain name it will only come or display with a post name or page name. That's very important. There are many of beginner have noticed that they made this mistake they are using the default options and in the future if you change or update your post the URL uh, will be the same and any visitor if, if they visit your website or if they are visiting or reading any of your post maybe that post was created 2013 or 14 and they can easily recognize that it's a old post it's something like that so it's not good and the URL really not looks so good and hopefully you understand why you should change it after that uh, click save changes and we have updated our permalink and now go to pages there are default page here what I'm gonna do I'm going to create some default page so click over here let's type home and click here to add new page and type here about and then type here to add new page blog and also contact page so this is the default page that I have created and the second thing it's not second it's third steps that you have to navigate again from settings and reading to configure and set up your blog page by default if you visit your website you can see right now it's displaying the blog page um, the blog post at the front page right so this is your blog post here and it's displaying on the home page but if you do not want to display the blog post into the home page dynamically so you can create a static home page and later on we will be creating a blog here so first of all you have to make changes here inside settings and from reading change your latest post so as you can see your home page display your latest post which is by default I do not want to display my latest post like this way I'll be displaying latest post but in another way I will show you but here I'm gonna show you how to make static page so home page I'll be selecting the home and for the post I'll be selecting the blog page and click save changes that's it and if I go to now if I go to our home page it looks like this so it's home page and in inside this home page we can display blog content a lot of information we can also display our latest post there but the default blog archive page you cannot display so many things and that's not standard I hope you understand and that's the basic settings right